Hey everyone, it's Owen again, and as you can probably tell, I just got out of the shower because my hair looks wet, but anyway, I'm not going to do a movie review, but it's on a different kind of video, and that is a question I've been wondering for quite the past few months, even the last year. What's with the DC Extended Universe hate? For those who don't know, the DC Extended Universe is a universe of movies in based on characters from DC Comics, and they've had three movies so far, Man of Steel, Batman vs. Superman, Dawn of Justice, and Suicide Squad, and so far, they didn't really get great reviews, and I've always questioned that. When Man of Steel came out, I, I was really excited for it, because I love Superman, I, I personally like Superman Returns, maybe I should review that sometime, and a lot of people didn't like it, and I'm not sure why. A lot of people say the Christopher Nolan's Batman movies are the best movies in the world, but I haven't seen them, and I don't really know if I want to, but because Batman and Batman Returns are just two of my favorite movies, but I don't know why a lot of people didn't like it. I mean, yeah, it was a little long, but there are some good things about it, and I don't really know what it is people have with it. And after Batman vs. Superman came out, and... A lot of people were really excited for it, and it got hate again. I mean, it wasn't a great movie, but it was good. It had a little bit too many things going on, and it was a little slow-paced, but I enjoyed it for what it was. It didn't make my top ten last year, but I still enjoyed it. And then you had Suicide Squad, one of my favorite movies of last year, and a lot of people were looking forward to it, too, and... Not much people enjoyed it. Now, I know we all have different opinions, but why do people keep hyping up the DC Extended Universe movies and, and then they end up sucking? If they, if all of them end up sucking for them, then why do they go see them? It's weird, and I mean, yeah, I mean, a lot of people say that it they're not as good as the Marvel Cinematic Universe movies, and they say, oh, DC doesn't have... A, a lighter tone and a sense of humor. Remember the last time DC tried to make a lighter movie? <coughs> Batman and Robin. <coughs> and yeah, I don't really get what's with the hate. Not everything has to be a light-hearted, a low light-hearted fest. I mean, I don't mind lighter tones to action movies, just as long as they're not too over the top and childish, but not everything has to be like Marvel. I mean, I know Deadpool was not, it was more of a darker sense of humor, kind of like my kind of humor, but it, I'm more talking about the Marvel Cinematic Universe movies, but DC doesn't have to do everything Marvel does. I'm not one of those people that chooses which is better, DC or Marvel. To be honest, I have no problem with either of them. DC and Marvel, they're two completely different things, and some people are going to like them, some people are not going to like them, some people are going to like different things. Not everything is going to satisfy everyone. And I'm not a Marvel basher. No. Avengers is my favorite action movie of all time. And it's just that I have no I, nothing against the DC Extended Universe. I don't know why, what people have against it. I mean, there are no Batman and Batman Returns, two of my favorite movies. They're nowhere near as good as that, but I still really like the movies, no matter what. Plus, I mean, this is why Ghostbusters bonded the box office, even though I personally liked it, is that people didn't go see it because they thought it looked bad, but for the DC Extended Universe, people think they're going to suck, but they just end up seeing them. That's the thing with people. Why do they keep seeing movies that they think are going to suck? I mean, okay, yeah, I did see Ghostbusters, but it's just because people said it wasn't that bad. That's why I saw it. But if you are if you hate a specific universe or series of movies, what's the point of bothering with them? I personally am not a DC basher or a Marvel basher. I support both of them, and I like how they do different things. Just not everything has to be lighthearted. I mean, I don't mind lighthearted action movies. I mean, I, I appreciate movies that are trying to be a little more kid-friendly, but DC is kind of more aimed towards 
more mature people than children. And I can definitely see why. They, that explains my favorite superhero of all time, Batman. And he's a really dark superhero. So, Marvel, DC, different superhero uh, companies, they're all going to be something different for everyone. Everyone's going to have a preference. Some people can choose both. But I see it, I, what the problem is with the DC Extended Universe. I personally am looking forward to Wonder Woman and Justice League. Again, even some of the other movies are coming out after, like Green Lantern Corps, um, Cyclops, and a bunch of uh, other... And they're Aquaman, and they're making a Ben Affleck Batman movie. I don't see the problem with the movies. They're not perfect, but they try at least. And they're entertaining, to say the least. I don't care how well-made they are. Heck, movies in general, I don't care how well-made they are. I just care if I like them. And I like the DC Extended Universe movies. Okay, they're not perfect. They do have some flaws to them, but... I fairly enjoy them. No, they're not perfect at all. Heck, no movie's perfect, but... I personally have no problem with the DC Extended Universe... I'm not saying you have to like it. If you don't have to agree with me, you just have to listen. I see no problem with the T6 Dent Universe movies. I never had a problem with them. And they'll always personal it'll always personally be a great movie universe to me, and I hope to see all the other movies in the future, so later. And hopefully I'll do another review next.